Hi students, uh, I am Hit Shah and uh, I got all in rank 1 in NEET and uh, also all in rank 4 in AIMS 2016 and currently I am an MBBS student of first year at AIMS New Delhi. For that, I would, uh, in physics, I would say uh, thermal physics is very important in class 11th. Again, SHM and oscillations is also a very important topic. Uh, then again, in class 12th, I would refer to electrodynamics as an important topic and uh, communications and uh, the last two chapters of physics in class 12th, which are generally ignored by students, but they are quite important. And for chemistry, in organic chemistry, the thing is that all the reactions of class 12th are very important, and not so much of class 11th. But the thing, uh, in inorganic chemistry, I would go for the main important basic concept is a periodic table. And if you can understand, you can understand all the trends of periodic table and chemical bonding as well, then I think it is very easy for you to remember in inorganic chemistry. You know, if you know what is the theory, logic behind that, then the SPDF logs won't seem much difficult as they actually seem. Because inorganic chemistry generally requires more of memory, and if you can remember all this stuff, which is given in CRT. For physical chemistry, I think if you like physics, then you would like physical chemistry as well, because it is mostly based on logical formulas and other kind of stuff. So, if you can practice more numericals in, in uh, physical chemistry, then it is good for you. For biology, I think all the chapters are equally important, and uh, especially important are uh, in class 11 that is morphology and anatomy and physio of plant and animals both. And uh, in class 12, I would go for ecology, which actually holds much importance in the exams as well. And it is actually very light and you know, very relaxing chapter. So that is the thing which we focus if you are uh, want a good selection in your exams.